My name is Chris. And I'm Jolene. And we're a family of five uh, from Texas that sold everything and moved aboard a 47-foot trawler to live on a boat. Yes, it's true. true. We're the Nat I'm Carter. I'm Chase. And I'm Kayla. About a year ago, our parents sold everything. Everything. This is our last and final move forever. Oh my gosh. I'm on like an adrenaline rush. You're good here to turn. <laughs> We're moving. Woohoo! Goodbye, Key Largo. This is not quite going how we had hoped. These waves are massive. Kayla's not doing so hot. Half my family seasick just from a 30 minute drive. Nothing is working in this boat right now. Our washing machine broke an air conditioner broke, and our water won't run. And I am doing laundry by hand. So there's certain words you just don't want to hear on a boat. We're gonna flip! Some other ones we don't like, or what's that noise? Where's that water coming from? The funniest one we heard this morning though was, Dad, my turd's laying the wrong direction. <laughs> it won't go down. <laughs> oh my gosh. We're just swinging back and forth. I hate this. Chris is downstairs fixing the generator on top of everything. I hear something. Sure enough, we've run aground. After we ran aground, we needed to haul out and repair the keel before we could head off on our adventure. I'll tell you what, there's one thing I like more than anything in the world. You gotta be grinding fiberglass. <laughs> Homeschool in our boat takes many different forms. We use curriculum, but we also use real life experience. In our day to day lives, we learn a lot about math, science. Now I'm gonna use the physics of weight. Weather, navigation, geography, and marine biology. We're the real Swiss family Robinson. We figure if we can teach the kids something in real life, they might enjoy it a little more. We're doing it. We are crossing over to Bimini today. The fact that we see blue as far as the ice can see is just, um, it's a little surreal, <laughs> kind of nervous. The Bahamas are southeast of the Florida coast. We left the Miami area and crossed the Gulf Stream to Bimini. It is a day to celebrate. We are celebrating, celebrating, celebrating. Cheers. Boat life, or any life, is not always what we plan. From day one of leaving America, we experienced one struggle after another. Through all the highs and lows, we have learned to find joy in any and all situations. We are finally able to breathe, relax, and enjoy living on our boat and traveling the Bahamas and beyond. Living the dream. So we don't know what our plans are or even where our final destination is. We sure don't know what the next year has in store for us, but we're gonna do our best to enjoy the journey and learn along the way always. Whatever and wherever that may be. How was that? Great. Me, man, I have made fire. <laughs>